So this is going to be my second favorite indicator strategy that I'm going to mention. Uh, first one, you see up here, where I've mentioned it many times, the EMA and the, the 13 and the 48 I keep at, that's the first two that I keep uh, for anything, but the third indicator is always something different uh, to kind of, kind of help the strategy. So if you look, the second favorite, I do the MACD. And what I ended up doing is you'll notice these lines down here, the lines up here, much like the same thing where you're where you're looking for the crossover with the, the EMAs up here. With the MACD, whenever the lines are below, below the bars here, whenever the MACD is below, that is my buy zone. It, it also helps when the blue line is crossing down here. And when it goes up past all the bars, that's when I sell. And, you know, what also helps is you see the blue you see the blue line going down that's a signal to me that it's going to start going down so if the lines are down here and the blue line is uh, crossing down here it's a signal to me to buy and when it when it gets up here and it starts going the blue line starts going down it's a signal to sell so with the MACD uh, that is a buy zone and up here at the top that is a sell zone so that is another method that I use when I'm doing my day trading. 